I just wanted to touch back and also agree with our cemetery system here. Uh, I kind of would like to see before we do anything here, since you kind of said you, you're, you're not even seeing figures, you're being told by state people and stuff, of, let's, let's finalize this paperwork and find out where we really stand because no, I don't want to be in the cemetery business neither, but it sure seems like a band-aid being put on a, a big open wound that we don't know how big the wound is. And, and I think we got to find out if we're going to eventually own it anyways. You know, I, I don't know. There's a lot of unknowns here of saying that, you know, there's 97000 or 90000 They spent money out of there they weren't supposed now, to. Now, I want you to hear it clearly. It was $98,000. $98,000. They borrowed 15000 Take away fifteen from ninety-eight. The ninety-eight was generating approximately five thousand dollars a year in interest. It's not generating that much because fifteen thousand. They owe themselves fifteen thousand dollars. I haven't physically seen it, but I talked to two state people that didn't have a reason for why. The board members are in their eighties, most of them, and they don't have a reason for why. Um, well, well, if you well, want to see the books, why don't you want to answer some books? The point I'm making is it's kind of hearsay. You're saying you don't know, but what the money they took out of that account was was that legal? Did they have good bookkeeping practices? Obviously, there's some flaws. They, they can there. borrow the money from themselves and pay it back. And my yeah, point yeah. is that I'd like to see a table until then. Okay. Uh, anyone else? Trish, on the resolution. 